Hey guys, welcome to another video about Frontline Trooper. I'm actually going to do a fifth part for my SMG tutorial, uh, mainly because you guys have been sending me messages saying, Hey dude, you've shown me how to make it all, but how do I actually get the stuff? What measurements do I use and what material do I need? So, this tutorial is on how to do it. Now, um, the picture that you'll be using uh, is in the link below. This link will take you straight to the Google Images one that I use, and then it's up to you to crop it down to just select the side one you want for your thing. There's no point in taking the back view of the SMG if you're making the whole side part. It just won't work. Alright, so we are, first of all, you're going to need your paper, which then you'll stick onto your uh, styrofoam. Now, the styrofoam I use is just a. I had a big two by one meter block of it. It is the perfect width for the SMG as it is, um, uh, what is it, three centimeters thick. I think it's still pretty thick. My SMG was done at three centimeters thick and I just dug into it, as you can see. Now, the, the measurements for the, um, what do you call it, uh, piece of paper, uh, you're going to want it to be Turn it around. You're gonna want it to be 42 centimeters in. Uh, no, hold on. You're gonna want it to be 45. I repeat, 45 centimeters. That's the length of the SMG, excluding the um, barrel. So right up to the tip of the gun point. So 45 centimeters in length. Now you could do that on A3 if you have an A3 printer, but I'd made it easier by actually getting the picture. Extending it to uh, 45 centimeters and then putting it on A4. As you can see, my A4 sheet here, and simply I print that off, which means it only print from here downwards. And once I've printed it off, I just simply hold down the right arrow and I'll just skip it and move it across to where it has to be from wherever it was cut off last. Put that on that side and then put it on the other side. Print that off, and then you're only left with the end of the barrel. So 45 centimeters takes about two and a quarter of an A4 sheet because each um, A4 sheet is 21 centimeters in width. So 21, 21, 42 plus an extra three is going to be 45. So yeah, two and a bit of A4 sheets width. Now the height of it is going to be um, what is it? It is height roughly. About 19 centimeters, 19, 20 centimeters, I'd say. Just measure that. Give me a second. Yep, 19 centimeters. So it's going to be 19 centimeters, and then you're actually going to build on the extra parts. So 19 centimeters from here, no, sorry, here, right below this ridge area. So from here to the end of the bottom gun. Then you're just going to build on the extra um, scope which can just be done out of a separate piece of styrofoam and then you're going to build on these armor utility, uh, what do you call it, um, armor magazine it's an armor magazine, extra magazine and just little other things that you want to put on it so yeah, 42 from here to here, 19 and then just build on extra stuff now the barrel I used was just a, um, not a toilet roll but a roll from like a paper towel thing. So that was originally, I think, what could it have been? Um, 30 centimeters long, but I cut it down to what it's supposed to be, which is 23. So that's 23 centimeters long, which is actually a very good size to put on the end. So it's just a 23 centimeter roll, and I just put a 